Okay, so I've got the two inverters wired up. And so the next thing I want to do is wire the AC input. So that's going to be from here. This is the AC. This is the input to the system. Leg one, leg two, neutral and ground. I'm going to use this wire, drop through here. Power will come from this transfer panel. The output of this transfer panel powers the solar. This wire. The input to the transfer panel will be either the utility, it'll be this wire, or the generator, which I haven't started on yet. Okay? So I'm going to start with putting in this wire right here. Let's get started. Leg two, neutral, and ground. This is the input AC. Comes through here, down through here, and up into here. Cutting it along this ground wire. of the transfer switch, common, hot one, hot two, well hot one, hot two. Bringing in the utility side, white common is going to be the longest run, so we'll start with that one. Okay, so I got half of the transfer switch wired. I've got the AC in from the utility, and I've got the output of the transfer switch over to the solar input. So now I gotta fish the uh, AC power from this panel. This isn't the main panel. This is a 100 amp uh, panel that comes off of the main panel from the house. So this is shut off right now. I'm gonna run uh, a 60 amp breaker in here. That'll be the input to the solar. But I got some fire blocking in there, so I'm going to have to cut a hole in the wall, get a drill and drill through that fire blocking so I can get the wire through there. I'm going to cut a hole right around here so I can get up in there and drill through it, and then i got to get up through this one. I cut it at an angle, so it's like you're cutting a pumpkin. And that way you cut the piece out, and you can put that piece right back in, and it's not that hard to patch the wall. Now I gotta cut a hole in the through the two top plates and get the wire into the attic. Alright, well, got the wire through the top plate. Now I gotta fish it down through the wall and the fire break. Bingo! Right, I got you now, sucker. Now I gotta fill in these two holes. This is the piece that I cut out of there. Look at that. Like a professional. This is the breaker. I'm going to 60 amp breaker for the solar. So I'll strip it back up here and wire it in. One and hot two. Oh, 
this is the utility supply to the solar. You got the L1, L2, you got the common here, and we got the ground over here. It's on this 60 amp breaker. This whole thing shut off. So next we're gonna do a little test to see if all this power ends up in the right place in the right way.